Now we're dealing with mental health issues. Now we're dealing with people that are actually assaulting us, but we don't have the backup to handle that. What are we supposed to do at this point? Tucson firefighters actually taking to social media now to address staffing issues. Nine Your Side's Natalie Tarangioli spoke with them to find out more about the problems the department is facing. Tucson Fire says their difficult jobs recently became even more so. Mario Carrasco with the Firefighters Association says the fire department is short-staffed and the firefighters are being assaulted in certain parts of town. He says over the past year is when he has seen an increase in assaults. TPD was there on the spot wasn't that big of a deal, but now we've got assaults and TPD doesn't have the units to send to us. Now it's a huge deal. Carrasco says now firefighters are learning self-defense. In this day and age, who'd have thought that firefighters have to learn how to disarm somebody, uh, how to take a weapon away from somebody. He says these problems aren't new and now they're taking it directly to the public. This is the post on Tucson Firefighters Association's Instagram page. They say over the last year they've seen an increase in assaults and on top of a staffing shortage, they say this creates the perfect storm. The Fire Association says they've worked with city officials to get pay raises earlier this year. Now we want them to sit down with a city manager and say, how can we make your operation more efficient? Don't just be firing barbs over, over social media. Sit down at the table and let's have a productive conversation. Around 30 firefighters are expected to start an academy next month to help staffing issues. Natalie Tarangioli, Kega 9, on your side.